Hello again, this is Dr. Fujian Zane, and this is the Ask Me segment. So um, someone had asked, what do I do with my anxiety that is uh, raising constantly, whether it has to do with COVID or all that's happening in the world right now and my own circumstances and my anxiety keeps happening. So what do I do? Well, um, the first thing to look at is when you have anxiety, there's a physical sensation and there's a cognitive concept. There's a thought process. So there's a thought process that ignites the emotion of uh, anxiety and then the feeling, the emotion of anxiety shows up in your body and sends your body into a reaction of fight, flight, or freeze. So um, two component, we're going to watch both. If it is in your body, you first want to release it by taking deep breaths, by exhaling long, by sinking, dancing, walking, running, uh, trying to get that out of your system as a physical symptoms. Don't sit in your anxiety. The worst thing you could do is to sit in your anxiety because your body is going to go bubbling and then you'll have, you'll have your heart rate going and you'll, you'll be sweating and you'll feel dizzy so the best thing you could do start walking start jumping up and down maybe even a small trampoline um or uh, then um start taking deep breaths and you could do all of that right when it comes to your cognition your thought process anxiety usually looks like um, a fear of unknown, a fear of the future that might be unknown or even negative, and even unknown appears for us as a negative. So um, we'll create all of this scenario in the future that we get ourselves scared of. What if, what if, what if, what if, what if, and all the what ifs are not the positive ones, because if you if you look at the what if positive, you're going to have a smile and you look happy, but you're going to go after all the what ifs that are actually negative. So first thing you want to do is to look at, to do a reality check. One, it's not in the present time. I'll get there when I get there. Um, two, is it even, how real is it for the possible it is for us to happen? Three, if it's actually going to happen, what is it that I can do? What's up in my control? And let me look at what's in my control and do something about it. And fourth, is there anything I could do about it right now? If you say yes, please do. Do what you think you need to be doing to clear whatever it is in the future that might happen that might be inappropriate or upsetting to you. And if you say, no, there's nothing I can do, then the point would be like, let it go. And if it happens, then I'll deal with it because every strength, every skill that you have for that time to handle it, it might be different than what you have today, but all the skills you already have, if it happens, then you'll handle it as much as you're going to handle it, right? And then bring yourself back into the positive space of where you are today, the things you do have control, the greatness that you have around you, the gratitude that you can uh, feel about what's around you, and take that into consideration and uh, feel blessed for now.